the voice of a legend has passed away. Ladies and gentlemen, assistant coach Brendan Malone. I think it hits everybody because if you ask people, everybody felt like they knew him. Ken Calvert, his voice heard on local radio in Detroit for decades, but most remember and love him as the cherished public address announcer for the Detroit Pistons. And Ken came out and he just had, he had fun with it. And then he invented this call on Joe Dumars and a different call for every player. And a guy would score and it could be a Johnson. For nearly 16 years, Calvert was the PA announcer for the team. And when he took on that job, he ran with it, changing the game and scoring the best way he knew how with his voice. Until he came in, it was always a basket by number 23, John Smith. But Calvert's vibrant voice captivated the fans. And you wrote on his voice and there was a magic there uh, that helped bring everything alive. As the former president of the Detroit Pistons and the Palace, Tom Wilson and Calvert not only worked together, they became friends. In fact, Wilson remembers when Calvert attended a Pistons game in New York and realized he created something big. And he says, suddenly we've got a, a bathroom full of people going, Joe Dumars, Joe Dumars in New York. And uh, uh, he said, that's when I knew I made it. Would it be safe to say that he turned sports into entertainment? I think he, he played a big part in that. But despite all Calvert did for radio and sports, Wilson says Calvert's greatest legacy is the compassion he showed others. The best legacies that you can have and leave behind you is people saying to other people, what a great guy he was and how much I miss him. And we're all going to feel, as I say, a, a great emptiness in us with uh, his absence. And Southfield, Ingrid Kelly, Fox 2 News.